Mason here on the Synthedelic channel. This time it's gonna be an updated version of my Mark I Ride the Lightning Tone for the Katana. For this one, I uh, started with the original amp preset that I had, so let's get into it. Got 20 on the gain, 65 bass, 35 middle, 64 treble with a 30 presence and a deep cabinet resonance. The contour is not on. My global tone EQ is this right here. I use this for all of my tones. Variation is not turned on. And this is what it sounds like with no effects added at all. Pretty muddy, pretty flabby. Let's add a Tube Screamer. I got a parametric EQ and a graphic EQ. This one, taking out the frequencies that make it all flabby, boosting up some of the scratchier palm muty type sounds. This one's taking out a lot of the bass. It's pretty much the V shape that they would have on a Mesa Boogie, but it's before the amp on this. It's chain 4-1. I got modulate delay turned on. This is to double the, the uh, input. You can turn this off if you want. I like it. I think it sounds more like the album when it's turned on like to double, to double the guitars. Here's without that. Here's with it. It's very subtle. I have some delay after the amp. You can turn that off too if you want. I got some reverb. You can turn this off if you want, but I like, I think it should be there. Solo is turned off, not even using the EQ, not using the contour. The two global EQs for the preset. This one is taking out a lot of the, the mids. Specifically at a thousand uh, hertz. Second one, taking out more of that muddy bass and taking out some of the scratchy, like B type, like B's in there, the 8, 8K. And it's got a high cut at 10. Both of these do. That's basically this t the tone. Uh, I haven't done any post processing uh, to the recordings at all. What you hear is what came out of the amp. I'm using a SM58, and that's going into a Behringer mixer, a Xenix 802 mixer, and then that through USB is going directly into my computer. Thank you. 